Yeah, this one's a game. Hey, I can tell you one thing me and Kale were really good at in 2016 were picking up games. I mean, we used to I have a bunch games. in here. We were very good at picking up games. Like we had a great feel for each other and a great feel for that. You know, we really uh, we I think kind of sometimes we wish it was a game because it was easier for us, huh, Kale? Yeah, because you're not on you're not on an island anymore when it, when there's a game you have you have help. And this is kind of like that same idea with dealing with like the penetrator first instead of the looper, you know, like Donald making sure that um, the penetrator is secure before worrying about the guy looping around because that's the guy that's more of a threat to the quarterback. He has a beeline on the quarterback. So just a good job being patient and making sure that the games are getting passed off. Definitely. And one thing I used to do too, if tackles are watching this, like when my guy goes inside, I yell out inside, inside. So KO has an alert that he's coming. You know, and then with the uh, with the uh, TEs, you know, I would yell, I would tell KO switch. So he knew I said I, I got the three techniques secured, so he feel comfortable going back inside for the looper. So you know that vocal stuff, even those loud, loud stadiums, you know, I think I, I hope he will hear a little bit of it. You know, just try to help him yeah. out on the side, yell inside when we're if it's a TE, I'll yell switch so he knows I got the three techniques uh, secure so he can jump inside. So those little things, you know, help out. And that's something that we practice. We drilled it all the time in practice. Like we communicated during a, a team pass. We communicated during a one-on-ones when we ran games and stuff like that. Depending on who we were playing, we'd have like different games that the defense would do when we practice against them. And we we would do the rep over again. If you weren't loud enough, if you weren't vocal enough, if you didn't quite throw like throw your guy over there, you were too impatient on the on the on the looper, whatever it was, we would do the rep over until we got it perfect. Like we never left a rep out there without it being perfect. Like even if it was wasn't kind of planned in there and they they beat us on a game or something, like on one on ones, we'd literally just be like run it back, like try it again, do it again, like get back on the line. Like we just never it had to be perfect. 